Good day and welcome to the channel. In this very short video, we're going to show you something Microsoft calls joyful animations. Yes, the air quotes are super cool, I know, and so is this. So have you ever received an email and had it have a confetti cannon like this? Boom, pretty cool. Well, that's joyful animations. And there are three different words you can use. Well, two and a half different words you can use to make it happen. And there are some restrictions on it. We'll also explain how to just turn it off altogether. The first thing you need to know is it only works with Outlook Web Access. So OWA, Outlook Web, it doesn't work with Outlook Mobile, it doesn't work with Outlook on the desktop, although it will be coming to both Outlook Mobile and Outlook on the desktop, uh, presumably at some point in the not so foggy future. The second thing you're going to want to know is what words can be used and can they be used multiple times and so on and so forth. So let's Drill into that pretty quickly. So we'll go bring up a new email. And yes, I'm creating this with Microsoft Outlook just to prove the point that it's not the tool that creates it. Uh, it is the product that opens it. So if somebody sends you an email from Outlook, you will get uh, with these special words in it, you will get the confetti cannon. If you uh, have it sent to you from Yahoo, uh, you will have the confetti cannon. If somebody sends it to you from Gmail, you will have the confetti cannon. Send that to myself just so you can see it. Call this test A. And we'll call this, we'll just put congrats. Exclamation mark. You tip, you don't need the exclamation mark. Click send. And there's my message. And when I open it here, nothing happens. Even if I mouse over it, I get nothing. But check this out. If I go to Outlook Web Access, the first time it's opened, it will fire the confetti cannon. And each time I mouse over it. Now let's get rid of that and we'll do a couple more things that we'll show you how to turn it off if you don't like that. It's pretty straightforward. I'll send it to myself again. So the three words or more correctly two and a half phrases you can use to fire the confetti cannon are happy birthday, congratulations, and the third is congrats. Sort of a derivative of course of congratulations. So let's just write a quick message. There we go, and I'll send this off. And now when I open that message, see the words firing, so you can use it multiple times. You can use the different words. You can use the same word over and over again. If you put congrats five times, you'll see the confetti cannon pop up five times. And the last thing you might wanna know is how to turn it off. Well, in Outlook Web Access, which is the only thing that it works in, it's simple enough. Click the cog in the top right-hand corner. Make sure you're on the mail menu item. Click Compose and Reply. Scroll to the very bottom and you will see joyful animations and you can just turn those off if you don't like them. And click save and the next time you receive a message with those words, the confetti cannon will not fire. Hey, if you like this video, please give us the big thumbs up. We'd really appreciate it. Subscribe's also always appreciated. And if you have any questions or concerns, you can always get a hold of us directly at www.urtech.ca. That's www.urtech.ca. Thanks and have a great day. Bye-bye.